the difference between ar raja which is hoping for the reward from Allah, and at tamanni which is wishful thinking, is that the good one, which is the hope for the reward from Allah, there is an action with it. So the person would believe in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and hope for the reward from Allah. This is an action. A person would establish the salah and hope for the reward from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Stay away from sins and he hope for the reward from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and so on. Be kind to others, seeking rewards from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alone. Having good expectations of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The wishful thinking which is negative is when a person just dream that he will be among the people of Jannah. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will have mercy on him and he doesn't believe, he doesn't search for the truth, he doesn't establish the prayer, he does not help the needy, he does not give his zakah and so on and so forth and keep on wishfully thinking that he will be okay. And this is definitely something that is condemned in the Quran. لَيْسَ بِأَمَانِيِّكُمْ وَلَا أَمَانِيَ أَهَلْ الكتاب. It shows that the nisbah or the relationship between a slave of Allah, a human being, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is not because of our parents or our lineage or to claim that we're among the Muslims or this or that. It's by our own actions of being slaves of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the ubudiyah to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is what saves the person. This is what brings the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala on us, our speech and actions to be truthful with what we say and what we believe.